Good morning everyone, this is Beliza. Welcome back to my channel. Um, today I want to do um, a Happy Crafter haul and a quick little project share. Um, I did make this when I got my design team package. I did use the new um, cracked beads from her shop. I just love the color of this yellowish orange. They added um, Caffeine Queen. She gifted me this pumpkin spice latte, um, ready to be dangle. Then I used beads from her um, coffee kit that I got a while back. So these are all beads from the Happy Crafter Shop. It's all jumbled up, but I just love the fall colors. And then I used her um, balls from her shop. You guys know the balls. Um, these ones, so I did use her pink and orange ones. And then I also used these ones, these circle ones. Love, love, love. So it makes it fun. And then I add some random uh, candy clay pieces in there to make it look like a candy bucket. And this um, die used. You guys need to go check out the Sassy Club. She has these um, McDonald-inspired old-school um, Halloween candy buckets. So um, the set does come with um, two different tops, that and the handle with the three faces. And then the add-on comes with the entire base piece with the shaker element. So you could get the bucket or the shaker add-on so i love it i was just in the middle of making um some cards yesterday but um something happened yeah i wanted to make some cards for um the what world card crafting day i don't know what you guys call it <laughs> but um i was in the middle of making a few of these um i left this part off because i was going to add like a little tag to the little handle but this is such a cute die set so go check out the sassy club and get your balls from the happy crafter shop i just love them because it gives you that um shaker sound and helps you know the paper pieces and whatnot move around in your shakers uh smoothly okay she has the new pink foam squares so i grabbed three orders of these. I haven't used it yet. I need to test them out and see how good they stick. But other than that, you could always got, add glue, but you can't beat pink. That is so cool. So I grabbed three orders of that. I don't remember what I ordered. So yes, I ordered two um, sets of the stars. I think I'm going to grab more because I don't have any more orange or pink or purple. So I'm going to order some more of those. I ordered these. So cute. So they're just ready to go on a dangle. Ooh. More bells. Um, I got this trim. She has some trim in her shop. Lisa, you need to start um, holding some seam binding in your shop. Like trim and seam binding, I do not like go out my way to get. I'm always spending my money on dyes, which I need to uh, focus on getting other things as well. So this is a cute little pleated trim and um, the, it's red with white polka dots so it's going to be perfect for um, Christmas crafting and this white one has white polka dots as well. So very cute little trim. Then I had to get this frilly fufu one. Let's see. 
very cute. And you get a good amount on here, you guys. So I grabbed that for when I ever uh, craft for Prima or something. I grabbed more of this wax cord. Um, yeah, when I used it on my project, I just loved it. So I grabbed more. Grab more of these. I think these are going to come in handy crafting for Christmas. I just love the look of it. And then I had to grab this dangle. I think I'm going to make this for my daughter. We love horror movies. But this one has the little scream ghost face guy on the telephone. Very cute. I got that. And then I grab these spools. Yeah, these spools of thread. And it's huge. So I got this yellow goldish color and this pink one. And I do like to, you know, roll up some thread and add it to my project. So this is not going to be for sewing because I do not know how to use my sewing machine yet. That is uh, coming. I'm in my die cutting era right now, but soon I think. I think that'll be um, my goal next year is to learn how to sew, use my sewing machine. But yes, I just wanted to get this video out um, out this morning because I'm not going to be crafting today. Um, we got word that my father-in-law is in the hospital. He had a really bad accident. So we're driving up to Utah now. My husband just came home from work, so we're going to drive up to St. George to make sure his mom's okay and go see his dad. Um, what else? I did work on um, the gingerbread mini album from My Crafting World Designs, but I, the way my brain works, I was dead set using the new um, Doodlebug gingerbread paper line, but it hasn't came yet. I think it comes tomorrow. So I was trying to use other paper, but I wasn't inspired. So that's just been marinating. I did use um, Baking with Love from Doodlebug, but um, yeah, it was, I wasn't feeling it. So I'm waiting for my new Doodlebug to come in so I could craft with that. Um, and another ex exciting news, you guys. I hit a thousand subscribers. Oh my gosh. Um, Lakeisha and her daughter Anaya sent me a little video um because i sent something out to anaya and they congratulated me for reaching a thousand i did not know that i hit a thousand so yay thank you guys for supporting me i do appreciate you guys go visit the happy crafter shop use code meliza10 to save um definitely check out um her trims and stuff i think these are gonna come in handy once we start doing the christmas um crafting and get yourself all the colors of the balls that she has in her shop and what else oh the velcro she even has the um the green velcro the red so all the christmas colors um in her shop i do need to get the green ones for myself i do have the red but that is it you guys sorry i'm brushing off but i'm about to head out um, but I hope you have a safe and fabulous, uh, rest of your weekend and I'll catch you guys on the next crafty video. Bye.